Kristen Kruk fled Xavmas Allison Mac fell under sex cult spell. No one could save her. Kristen Kruk allegedly introduced Smallville co-star Allison Mack to Xiv, but a former member tells us exclusively that she fled once she heard rumors it could be turning into a sex cult, while Allison stayed on. Former Smallville star Kristen Kruk, 35, has admitted that she took part in the controversial women's self-help group Xiv, but she claims she left before witnessing any of the alleged sex cult activity that the group's founder Keith Rainier and Kristen's former co-star Allison Mack have been accused of. The pair have been charged with sex trafficking sex trafficking conspiracy and conspiracy to commit forced labor. A former member of XIVM says she heard whispers about what was going on and bailed from the group before she had a chance to find out if the horrible rumors were true, and that Kristen did the same thing. Some years ago I started hearing some strange things about Keith manipulating women into having sex with him. People in XIVM were starting to question his motives and that's when I got out and a number of other people left at that time too including Kristen. She didn't hang around to wait and see if the rumors about Keith were true. She cut ties immediately and I give her a lot of credit for that. Unfortunately for Allison she was already too far under Keith Rainier's spell to think independently. No one could save her. A former member of Xivm tells Hollywood Life. Com exclusively. As the scandal around Xivm continued to grow in late winter of 2018, the Canadian-born actress took to Twitter to admit she had been part of the group but left before witnessing anything nefarious. On March 29th she wrote, When I was about 23, I took an executive success program, Xivm Intensive, what I understood to be a self-help slash personal growth course that helped me with my previous shyness, which is why I continued with the program. She said she later left and had minimal contact with members including Allison and that, the accusations that I was in the inner circle or recruiting women as sex slaves are blatantly false. She added words of concern for the women who have come forward with claims about being branded on their hips with Mac and Rainier's initials, as well as coercion into having sex with Rainier. I am horrified and disgusted by what has come out about DOS. Thank you to all the brave women who have come forward to share their stories and expose DOS. I can't imagine how difficult this has been for you. I am deeply disturbed and embarrassed to have been associated with CIV. I hope that the investigation leads to justice for all of those affected. DOS stands for Domine Subsequius Sororium, Latin for Master over the slave women which the group was allegedly also known as.